Ask Reddit by Strolar. What is something free from the internet everyone should take advantage of? Goodrix. If you haven't seen the depressing commercials, this is an app that gives you discounts on prescription medications. My dog has epilepsy and I save about $200 a month on his pills. If you still have an independent pharmacy in your area, please consider supporting them instead. For many drugs they are cheaper than the big chains in the first place, but they are often price match too. Discount cards like GoodRx save you money but charge the pharmacy a fee on every claim. Needy Meds is another good resource. Not exactly legal, but, Z Library, https colon slash slash, b dash ok, dot cc, slash closed bracket has pdf copies of almost every publication ever, including books, magazines, textbooks, and science journals. I use it for pdf copies of books I already own. It does nothing but free up space. That's cool, not exactly legal is Reddit's second name. HTTPS colon slash slash, have it been pwned.com, slash is a website that checks through a database of breaches to see if any account associated with your email has been compromised. Edit, being wound is pretty common, especially if you use the same email for many websites. There is no need to be concerned if you have been wound multiple times. Almost all will be from mass data breaches and it is unlikely you will ever be targeted specifically. However, it is a good idea to close accounts you no longer use and to change the passwords on accounts you use regularly. I have been wound. On Club Penguin rewritten and Canva. Any student stuck on paywalls to see studies? Here's a way to get around a lot of them. See Hub. Removing barriers in the way of science, https colon slash slash c dash hub dot tw slash close bracket. It's made by the same people that made library genesis http colon slash slash gen dot lib dot rus dot ec slash close bracket. https colon slash slash unsplash dot com slash right square bracket open bracket https colon unsplash com comma free super high quality photographs i also use as reference for sketches artwork pixar bay and pexels too i bring to you radio garden my friend radio stations from around the globe just spin it a bit and click where you want to get a list of radio stations from that country Great for people who like foreign music, language learners, or people looking to reconnect with something back home. Alternatively, Worldwide Radio is an app for Chrome and Firefox that also has a list of global radio stations if you prefer that. Number of stations is much smaller, though. Libby is an app you can use to borrow audio books and ebooks for free as long as you have a library card, also free. Canopy is the movie streaming version of Libby. Also just as dope. Woodhippo. HTTPS colon slash slash. www.wordhippo.com closed bracket exclamation point. It is, hands down, the best online thesaurus ever. You can search synonyms and antonyms, and it includes slang explicit language, and multi-word phrases, all of which are typically excluded in other thesauruses I've used. This feature lets you find both more specific academic professional words and more general slang colloquial words. It's saved my sanity in term papers and texts alike. When you search a word or phrase, you get a page that breaks down synonyms by meaning and part of speech. Check out this page for lif https colon slash slash www.wordhippo.com slash what dash is slash another dash word dash four slash live dot html close bracket comma double quote with 11 verb usages 13 adjective usages and three adverb usages bonus i actually ended up using into word hippo while writing this comment wolf from alpha they have a lot of cool tools for math, science and even things like nutrition. 
I owe at least half of my physics degree to Wolfram Alpha. Stack of Airflow because I wouldn't be a developer without it. Your answer has been marked as a duplicate. HTTPS colon slash slash thinunproject.com slash has a wide selection of icons. I use them for presentations. Thanks. I didn't know about this. I'm probably going to use it in the future. 2B TV. It has a ton of movies. Not exactly box office hits but it's got movies and they change every month. I've watched movies like Fury and Airplane on there. Best part is you can get it in phone laptop, and PS4 as far as I know of 100% free, 100% recommend. Edit, they also have TV shows and anime. I've watched One Punch Man and Fairy Tale. Tubi has some of the best cheesy movies ever. I recommend watching the Velocipasta. Deleted. And also LibriVox which is volunteers reading books from Project Gutenberg. It's not always top quality, but it's nice to have. Basically people sign up to read certain chapters, or entire books, and record and submit them. So even the sight impaired can enjoy Project Gutenberg. And X200B. HTTPS colon slash slash LibriVox dot org slash right square bracket open bracket HTTPS colon LibriVox org TurboTaxUxus.com It's created by Hassan Minhaj with a list of websites to file free taxes with direct links instead of misleading users to paying. Hassan Minhaj talks about it in his Patriot Act Volume 6 episode Why Doing Taxes Is So Hard. Edit, wow, I'm really glad I watched this episode and happened to be on this post at the same time. I just wish this post was sooner than the tax due date. Thank you you Rependleton18 for my first gold and thank you you Energy Take a Lad for my first plus one award. I saw his episode and actually just used the site to file my taxes through TurboTax Free File, the real one. If you're a student or are really trying to stay focused at work there's an app called The Forest. Stay focused. I could be wrong but it's definitely The Forest. It's a free app that's available as an extension on Google Chrome or the Apple App Store. Basically, you plant a tree, set a time limit and you can only go on the sites that you've added to the whitelist or your tree will die. It's designed to stop you from always being in social media while you're supposed to be studying or doing something productive. I prefer stay focused, immediately blocks your access from any site. Edit, to clarify, you can set the blacklisted sites you want to block, and even a fixed period of time you have per day to browse those sites. EDX It's completely free online courses, usually 2-6 weeks per course, taught by professors from top-notch universities from all over the world, Harvard. MIT, Stanford, Oxford. It's just like taking classes from a university, with assignments, lectures to watch, etc. And the courses are varied and interesting. Another online news people don't think about is libraries. Go to your local library, get a card, and you get a huge selection of books right on your phone, Kindle, laptop, etc. You check out the books online and you get them on your device for 3 weeks usually. The book then deletes itself, but you can check the book back out if need be. It's completely free. Edit, here's a, edx, https colon slash slash, www.edx.org, slash closed bracket link. And did you know, if you want a credit for a course that you have taken on edx but the price is too high, usually $200 per credit, just send them a letter to explain for your financial problem 99% of the time they will grant you support for 90% of the cost for every credit. I took 5 damn quality credits for supply chain management from MIT, yes MIT, and only paid around $100. Supper stonk my friends, all my friends are enjoying this better than any course we have in university. Khan Academy. It's free, free knowledge. This got me through college. 
can't believe I haven't seen anyone say https colon slash slash www.photopia.com slash It's literally free photoshop, and it's even web based. My graphic design teacher taught us about photoshop with this site because the school didn't want to waste money on photoshop that kids would only use for one class. Fantastic site. You can do figuratively anything you can do with Photoshop the 9th of May 10 would recommend. A fun thing to just check out is, the first ever website, http, colon slash slash, info, dot cern, dot ch, slash hypertext, slash www, slash the project, dot html close bracket dot. Something else that's really cool is, the library of Babel. HTTPS colon slash slash library of bubble dot info slash closed bracket comma which essentially contains every possible string of letters, periods, and commas. At first glance it seems a bit uninteresting, until you realize every story, text message, word, thought, the names of every person who ever lived, the names of every person who didn't live, the secrets behind the creation of our universe, are technically within the many many volumes of the library. You can search anything you want in the library and it'll find it for you. It's honestly quite mind blowing. Gov track us. HTTPS colon slash slash www dot gov track dot us slash close bracket It's a website dedicated to tracking the bills and votes of Congress. You can find out who proposed what bill, when they did, and when they will be voting on it. Critical for staying in the know. Edit, turned it into a link so it's easier to access. My 90s TV HTTP, colon slash slash, www.my90stv.com, slash close bracket. This is more of a novelty website to kill some time, but I think it's pretty cool and you can easily lose yourself for hours with nostalgia. It basically uses YouTube videos to simulate watching TV in 90s and you can specify what year you want and what categories you want to see when you change channels. There is also a, my 80s TV, http, colon slash slash, www, dot my 80s TV, dot com, slash closed bracket and a, my 70s TV, http, colon slash slash, www, dot my 70s TV, dot com, slash closed bracket and the dev has said they are considering building one for the 2000s. Sometimes I just binge watch these. DaVinci Resolve is a great editing software. HitFilm Express is another great one. I started with DaVinci and found that HitFilm is more intuitive for me. Give both a try, see what you like. I always love the opportunity to be able to talk about HTTP colon slash slash archive dot org right square bracket open bracket ht p colon archive org comma because it is such a wonderful and free resource it has millions of free downloads for music https colon slash slash archive dot org slash details slash audio close bracket comma comma movies https colon slash slash archive dot org slash details Slash movies and film s closed bracket comma comma books https colon slash slash archive dot org slash details slash text s closed bracket comma comma software https colon slash slash archive dot org slash details slash software close bracket comma etc. One very popular example is that it is home to a very large catalog of Grateful Dead recordings. HTTPS colon slash slash archive dot org slash details slash Grateful Dead close bracket. There is also the Internet Arcade. HTTPS colon slash slash archive dot org slash details slash Internet Arcade closed bracket where you can play a lot of classic games along with the Console living room, https colon slash slash archive dot org 
slash details, slash console living room close bracket which is similar. They have access to tons of, old PC games, https colon slash slash, archive, dot org, slash details, slash classic PC games closed bracket to and you can even, play the original Oregon Trail online, https colon slash slash, archive, dot org, slash details, slash ms2 underscore oregon underscore trail underscore the underscore 1990 close bracket there's a lot more in their software section too https colon slash slash archive dot org slash details slash software close bracket it also has the wayback machine http colon slash slash archive dot org slash web slash closed bracket which has archived more than 451 billion web pages saved so you can go back and see how websites were years ago for example here's reddit on the 25th of july 2005 https colon slash slash web dot archive dot org slash web slash 20050725010627 slash http colon reddit com comma a month after it was created go on the here's reddit on the 25th of july 2005 link and then on the iphone link there's talk of the first iphone and people are basically not excited for it one person says it will be a disaster little did they know it would turn out to be the most popular phone in the world https colon slash slash archive dot org for the covid semester i forgot to rent some of my books for reading and this website had everything i needed for free it's also the only reliable website where i can watch norm mcdonald live to which is always a plus quizlet appenstax.org https colon slash slash appenstax.org closed bracket for free textbooks Khan Academy Yautub videos can teach you to do anything 7 cups https colon slash slash www dot seven cups dot com slash one six six four zero four three nine close bracket dot it is a free